Hello and welcome to a video I wasn't really hoping to make. Um, I guess this video is basically me announcing me quitting Car Crushers 2. Um, yeah, I am four, four months late or three months, but um, I finally got the motivation to record something. Um, as you can see, I'm doing a face cam. Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, I think it's time for me to leave the community, um, especially with my experiences I've had with the game and the community themselves. Um, it, it was fun while it lasted, I won't lie. I enjoyed playing the game a lot. And I mean, if the unfortunate events didn't happen to me, I'd still be playing the game. Definitely. But you know, there are some things that even if they get fixed, it kind of like still sticks with you. It kind of kills the whole game for you. I mean, me getting blacklisted was a really big part of it. Even though I'm unblacklisted now, I still lost my Master Crusher and I'm not gonna grind parts again to get it again. So it's kind of like, you know, I'm unblacklisted, yay. I can get some uh, race records, which I haven't done for three months as well. And also, I mean, working with the community, it's kind of like a horrible environment to be in. I mean, if you're part of the community, I mean, no hate towards you if I've never spoken to you, but the people I've spoken with, I really didn't end up liking them. It's kind of like, I would be depressed if I happened, if I was like completely committed to the community. Like the Car Crusher Discord server can be wild sometimes. But yeah, I mean, there are people that I don't really like being around that you can't really just avoid. And I mean, the, I, I saw a picture recently that Car Crush has changed, changed their name to Car Crushes 2 Vehicle and Physics Simulation or something like that. Now for Car Crushes to be going in that direction is also not a good thing. Like personally, I think I left the community and the game in the perfect time. And I mean like Floor 2 is over now as well. So everything's back to normal. And you know, it's one of those type of games that just kind of like get boring over a while as well. I've been playing grinding for two years straight. I regret it, I deeply regret it. If I spent that in a proper esports game, I'd be one of the best in the world at the moment. So you know, to think I spent my time grinding 50 million parts in the Roblox game that I quit, instead of grinding a real like proper esports game is kind of like, why did I do that, you know? I'm not gonna say it wasn't fun though, I had lots of fun in the moment, but looking back, I definitely regret it. And if you are going for the leaderboard, I do not recommend it. And I mean, the community as well, back on that subject, I mean, there was one time that I got like every single record on the dirt track leaderboard, I got all 100, and I got no congratulations, not saying I was seeking for it, I kind of just posted it for the fun of it, but like, there was one person who was like, when are we getting the update which doesn't determine world records with skill in a racing game, a racing game, in a racetrack, like, you know, it's all it's all hard cope with everybody over there like i don't know it's everybody trying to bring each other down if you get this many parts you're like it's like lol go touch grass noob you know i mean let, i uh, okay let's say i play trackmania okay trackmania is also a very you brought to grind for it you brought to stay determined to get your personal best and world records if i post anything there i'll be immediately congratulated and like encouraged to go and do better like, the difference in communities is crazy. And once I moved to Trackmania, I cannot move back to any Roblox thing. And I was kind of like, I'm not doing Car Crushers 2 anymore. The people I'm meeting are just getting worse and worse. I cannot be around this type of environment for myself. Like, I would never, I would never allow myself to be in front of those people. Um, so yeah, that's, Car Crushers is over for my channel. If you want to unsubscribe, unsubscribe, do whatever you want. I'm going to just keep on doing what I feel I want to do because my well-being this is my channel it's me so I know what I should do for myself and yes even though it was taking a two months break I enjoyed it a lot it was nice knowing that I don't need to make videos for a while but yeah I'm gonna leave all my car crushes videos up and everything don't worry about that you can rewatch them or something I don't know what you want to do but yeah, I'd like to thank you guys, of course, for watching all my videos, for getting me to over 2,600 subscribers with Car Crushes alone. It means a lot to me, you know, I did enjoy making the videos, and I'm happy you guys enjoyed watching them as well. I've got like over 500,000 views with Car Crushers, so it makes me really happy uh, that I managed to make it that far. Uh, but yeah, I mean, 
it's not really my thing. I don't want to put myself in that environment anymore. Uh, but yeah, I can recommend, I mean, you've got Modeler Coolest, you've got Danzig that makes a bunch of car crushes videos, you've got Bendy Place for the car crushes leaks. So yeah, you've got plenty of channels, don't worry about me, it's gonna be fine. Um, if you like me for who I am though, if you find me funny or something, um, I'll still keep making videos, I think, I hope, we'll see. But yeah, um, just not on car crushes, might still be Roblox, could be random games, I don't know. I'm quite enjoying Little Company right now, so maybe there will be videos on that, maybe YouTube live streams. I don't know, there's lots of room for opportunity and content now that I quit car crushers. But yeah, um, that's really about it. Just problems with the community and burnt out of the game, I guess. Not much I can really do about it, besides kind of step away, which is what I'm doing. But yeah, um, thank you guys, I appreciate it. And yeah, I guess we'll see where things go from here, I guess. Thank you.